Hey, 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 what's going on? I got a mono poison type battle here. Alright, so he's leading off with this Infernape, and I'm leaving off with my Lemur. This is a uh, substitute Black Sludge, uh, Brave Bird, U Turn, Taunt, Crobat, or Colbat, excuse me. I chose Colbat because Crobat is pretty high tier. And I'm just going to KO him with a Brave Bird and U Turn to get out of there, but these rocks proved to be extremely detrimental because I have. Focus Sash around this team. Okay, I'm trying to lay down a Sticky Web, but he ends up just killing me with the Scald, which I figured he would have done anyways. That Sticky Web would have been really useful this battle. Sadly, I don't get it. Alright, so I'm going to swap him to my 1981, which was the year AIDS was discovered. And just get him with a Gunk Shot. I luckily get the Poison that proves to be very helpful here, because he's not going to be able to KO me with the next Scald, and then I finish him off with a Payback. Which I didn't want to go for the gunk shot because I want, didn't want to risk the chance of missing. So I just used payback. And that's going to be a dead Keldeo. Excuse me, not Keldeo. Alright, so I'm looking like I have a lot of aids here. As he's going to go in to make me popular. He tries to kill me with a mock punch, but I live with 1 HP and then I get explosion off. There goes half his HP. That was actually pretty cool. I didn't really need it for anything else. That's a specially defensive Garbodor. Alright, so I'm going to swap in my Pedo King, which I made female on purpose. I'm just going to use Toxic Spikes because I'm terrified of his uh, Mega Cham. And he's going to knock off my Focus Sash, which is really no big deal. I'm going to use Protect just because, like, I, there's no reason not to. As I'm going to swap it to my Methane, what I'm trying to do is get a burn on this guy. Or just, really just get a burn on anything. So his, uh, his Mach Punch is doing nothing to me as I go ahead and get a Will-O-Wisp on him, which is great. As he's going to go ahead and knock off my Black Sludge, which is really bad, which means the only way I can recover HP is via Pain Split. Uh, I'm just going to do a Thunderbolt just for damage. I have a Thunderbolt and Dark Pulse on this. Uh, Dark Pulse to deal with Psychic types. And I realize, well, I can just go into Pedo King, let him die to burn, and then my strategy here was I was going to... I knew he was going to go to Mach Punch because he thought I was going to kill him with Brave Bird, but I'm just going to go for Substitute here. And considering I Quad Resist, I know I'll have enough HP. Yeah, that only does 14% to me, which is actually a substantial amount. Luckily, the burn does kill him, and it wasn't one of those things where the percentages are skewed. And now he's going to go into his Rico Jr., which I believe is a Dokapon reference. Here I go for the Brave Bird. I actually outspeed, oddly enough. I'm able to KO him. I'm pretty sure that was max damage, but if it wasn't, luckily the Poison came in handy. Uh, the Poison... Didn't really make a difference this battle. Alright, so I'm going to go into Methane. I'm trying to get a Pain Split off. Is he's going to go for Bullet Seed? If he didn't get this crit and got two Bullet Seeds, I would have been able to get the Pain Split off. Unfortunately, that's not the case. Okay, so now I'm left to my Choice Bandit Nido King, and he's got two of his guys left. So what do I want to lock myself into? Well, Ice Punch is probably the best thing. It will be a two-hit KO on the Terrakion, but he can probably KO off me with an Earthquake if he has it. Um, he does not have it. His best move to hit me with is Stone Edge. So it's going to be a 3-hit KO, and this is going to be a 2-hit KO, so I'm thinking, sweet, okay, I can definitely do this. But then, he gets a crit, but I live with 7% HP, and I'm able to get another Ice Punch off that's going to be Sheer Force to No Freeze, and that's going to be a dead Terrakion, so I'd live that with 7%. That was awesome.